let's look at how to join a game in mind test. You go to join game and you'll see all the servers. Your first time you'll register, make a name for yourself and make up a password for yourself. I checked out Pernia. It was at the top of my list and there were a couple people on just to see what it was like. And uh, so we're going to look at that. Some servers will take a while to load. When you first get to a server, um, you got to figure out how to survive if it's a survival server. Um, I like to get out of protected areas because you can't build or mine in protected areas. Then set up a, begin a quick base of operations where I get food and mining and start from there. So... <clears throat> see I have my home set here many servers have a slash spawn option yep so this would be spawn slash status to see who's on the server and it looks like all good is the only one on the server. If you mine in a protected area like this, see I took damage. So uh, you don't you don't want to do that. And it's a little bit they made a little bit of a maze to get out here. If you mine these, you'll take damage. Okay, so you will have to walk out of the area in order to, um, to mine anything generally. Some servers will have public farms. Let's see if this is a public farm. No, see I took damage. All right, so I, you know, I don't consider, I mean, if they don't, if you're taking damage and they don't have public farms or good directions, like this server doesn't have very good directions. You don't see signs directing you anywhere. Um, this door is protected. You can't go in. That's protected. Public machines, there's nothing written. It's probably a pretty new server. Travel net, you right click and then you click on where you want to go. You left click on where you want to go. The mods on the server, you do slash MODS to see what mods they have. You put it up uh, against a dark area in order to read it. And uh, what I'm going to do here is I'm going to do what I showed you on the um, on my server. Get some dirt. Now you can put water next to stuff to farm as long as it's adjacent to the tile. And one of the basic things on a server is to just set up a food source. If it doesn't have hunger, the food will increase your health. Okay, so to farm, we need a hoe. The 
cobblestone makes better tools than wood does, but you can make a hoe out of wood. This one does not have um, as big of an, the item slots as I did on the other game. I use the Dream Builder mod and then I modify the Dream Builder game and put in my own mods. If you want me to show you how to do a Dream Builder game, which is a collection of mods that make a server, and then how to customize it with your own mods, um, let me know and I'll do that. So let's see, we have wheat and oat. So let's plant wheat and oat. So we'll do three of the wheat, three of the oat. This will not do any, oh, F5 to see the tile. It will not do anything until the soil turns wet. It won't grow. But it will eventually turn wet as it's over a water source. Okay. Um, and let's see, slash status. And that was an introduction to Pernia. That was an introduction to Pernia. Thank you for watching.